This is the Anyone Bot M1 robotic lawnmower, the world's first fully intelligent mower with a dual perception. And what that means is that you do not need any perimeter fences, no manual mapping and not even an RTK positioning system because this right here is a vision based bot that is fully controlled by AI. It gets the real time camera data for navigation and also blade level tactile sensing, which is a genius new approach to the lawn mowing game. It senses the height as well as density of the grass and dynamically regulates the cutting speed as well as the mowing path. Now you know the nature of the dual sensing and the smart vision positioning combined with the smart blade action and also the bare metal brilliance positions the M1 as one of the most intuitive and possibly best lawn mowing robots of 2025. This right here is touch and go. The setup literally takes under a minute. Just one button it will start up the rest is fully automatic, but it can also be controlled over a companion app, which is currently still in production. This right here is a beta unit, at least when it gets to the software. But in any case, as I said, this is controlled by a cutting edge AI system, which you can see right here through the transparent body and there will be OTA updates. So yeah, looks and sounds amazing, right? But is it actually that good? Well, let's find out. New drip. Got a new drip from anyone but the M1 robotic lawnmower. By the way, if you're interested already, then check out the product links in the description. I will list and link the best deals for you. The M1 is currently getting crowdfunded, so don't miss out on all the epic early bird offers. Yeah, now let's check it out. So here we have the box, just blank on all sides. It's just a cardboard box. And when we open it up, we actually have two more boxes in here. So one with the paperwork and the machine in here. So I will pull it out right away. It is wrapped up. The second box will just cover the charge base. And down here in the box, we also have the ground spikes and the base. So there we go. Neat base. The box is now empty. So again, the base, the mower itself. Wow, that's looking so cool. Looking really spacey. And the accessories right there. So let's check it out right now. So right there we have the ground spikes or rather ground screws as well as a tool and tinier metal screws as well as right here spare blades. Then we also have the paperwork. So the quick start guide as well as page four and right here page two and three. And it is connected to a very long cable and we will check out the rest on the actual grass. But wow, it's looking awesome. Done with the unboxing. Let's get to my first impressions and then of course to a close overview. So there we go. Look at this thing. Looks epic. As you can hear, it's already on. It's talking to us and it's looking really cool, like a futuristic tank with this lifting brain right here. Absolutely amazing. And right here, triple blade on one wheel. So yeah, let's take a close look. So right here from the bottom, we have the front wheels that can turn freely, super smooth right there. As you can see, great wheels. And we have these on the back with strong protrusions. So this can go through any terrain, steep inclines, you name it. Then the cutter right here with the adaptive blade sensing. Warning, the machine is in emergency stop mode. Okay, so let's turn it over. So really nice, large wheels, great looking injection parts, injection molds right there. Here in the front, we have the charge ports and right there we have the vision system right here with the camera. That's looking great. And here the other side and on the back right there, we have a nice handle. So that's the metal frame right there. We can easily grab it right here and the specs right there. So it's very, very silent, 10 kgs of weight. And right there, we have the brand, it's weather safe. We have the emergency stop button right here. Really nice metal accents on top. Right here, we can look inside. And when we lift it up, we have the cutting height right here from 30 all the way to 60 millimeters. And let me show you, it will actually move the plate downwards and also upwards again, just like that. And to really see a difference, I think we will go for 40 right there. And right here we have the, okay, we still have the foil on, but we can leave it on. We just have the on off button. Okay, start and return to home. We are fully charged and a nice display in here as well. And that's the inner side of the lid. Not bad, right? So let's finally test it. 
Aside from downloading the app, the setup is literally as easy as powering up the base right there and then just slide it in. It will charge up and then it will also power up. We have three cool looking LED lights right there and we can position the base a little bit more right here. And now check this out. That's the lawn right there, absolutely huge. We have a an object in here as well. Yeah, that's pretty much the whole setup. The lawn is prepared. So we have a barrier right here as well as right there. But other than that, we have these tiles right here all the way to over here. And then the rest is, well, taller grass and bushes and stuff like that. So you could say it's a complicated area. And the craziest part is you just have to lift this up and literally just press on the start button. So let me set up a time-lapse camera and then we will go for an actual test. Okay, we can turn it off like that. Okay, restart, no problem. Now we can also see that. Nice cooling grill in here. That's the startup animation right there. Meanwhile, I can also pull this off. Oh, look at that, beautiful. Welcome to the intelligent robotic mod. Happy use. Start. Please enter pin code to unlock the machine. Okay, need to enter the pin code. Here we can two, three, it will work like that. Pin code input error. Please try again. Okay. Pin code entered correctly. The more is unlocked. So it's unlocked, so. Okay, so four times okay, then it will create the map. Let's see, we have the time-lapse cam up there. So let's check that out. And after the mapping, it will return right here. So right there, I just had to save it. Right there, the grass is sufficiently tall so that it's actually recognized as a border. So garden prep is of the essence, but it's doing a great job so far. And it's also handling the slope without any issues. So here we have a good border, but yeah, right there, the grass was too too small so it went a little bit in here it did not go in here it recognized that right away and now i think we are pretty much done yes sir okay confirmed i had just confirmed the map okay great so that was a success it's now going back to the dock good stuff Okay, it will start. Let's go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we can see the difference right there. Yeah, it's a clear difference in when it gets to the cutting height. We could even go deeper. So all the way to 30, close to 30. Yeah, clear difference right there. It's really, really silent. Wow, nice. You can especially see it right there where the three blades did the cutting. Wow, look at that. That's awesome. That's a huge lawn for this little guy right there. And the sun is almost setting. But I think we can go for a few lines at least. And really nice results. That's a perfect cut right there. Super sharp razor blades. And look at those straight lines. Love it. So there we go, back to charging. It will go back to charging once the battery runs low and then it will resume the job. And as you can see, really clear and a great result. Beautiful straight lines, great results. That's the cut right there. I mean, look at that laser precision. And it was able to do all this right here. That's a good 500 square meters, I think, maybe like 400. But regardless, goes to show that these lawn mowing robots are becoming more and more similar to robot vacuums. They will now scan the perimeter. You don't have to do this manually with a great precision. And then it's also fully automatic in all regards. Just one click, it will do the map, then just start, set up a schedule and you will have a perfect result always. And as you saw, my grass was quite tall. So if you go for a daily mow or every second day, then you will have really, really small grass fragments that will fall through and turn to biomatter pretty much in a few days. Then you will not even see these huge piles of leftovers and you can get amazing results with the M1. So yeah, massive thumbs up from my side. This thing is awesome. 
So as you saw, excellent build quality as well as hardware with a really cool design. And I especially love the transparent upper lid. It's so cool, absolutely epic. And all those features and capabilities for such an incredible price point. It is so much better than the competition, especially in this price segment. I'm absolutely amazed, just one button. That's all it takes, that's all you need. The system is of course still being fine-tuned, talking about the software side. And as I said, there will be OTA updates, but as it is straight out of the box, it is already performing much better than most of the robotic lawnmowers that we've tested so far. So top tier value right here. Anyone bought just always brings amazing value to the table with great looking devices and a top of the line ecosystem. And my favorite aspect is this completely new approach to the game. It's fully AI based, one tap and lean back. It is weather adaptive IPX6 waterproof. It can navigate narrow spaces. It facilitates narrow edge cutting as well as multi-zone mowing and scheduling and of course much much more. So all in all the Anyone Bot M1 is a definitely grippy. Check out the product links in the description. I will list and link the best deals for you. Don't miss out on the epic early bird offers but before you go smash that like button and subscribe. Ring the bell and click all to never miss amazing tech magnet videos. That's it for this one. Enjoy your day and I will see you soon.